Hey everyone, welcome to Financial Freedom by 4D. I wanted to do another video for the Six Figure Side Hustle Challenge just to share my thoughts on Side Hustle number six, which is the children's book side of things. So, as a lot of you will know, I published a children's book earlier this year. Uh, it's in the hard copy version. It was published in, at the beginning of April this year. And so far that's going really well. It's been quite exciting. Um, almost 300 books now are out and about in the community, which is so cool to see. I got to do my first book reading to a preschool uh, last week, which was just so awesome to actually get to see um, the children interacting with the book and to meet them and to hear all their questions about uh, the story behind the book as well. So that was really cool. Um, but in terms of the book as a side hustle, um, one of the things I wanted to talk a bit about was about um, getting the book from just having it as a physical um, hard copy and into uh, selling uh, it digitally around the world. So um, as you know, for the Six Figure Side Hustle Challenge, some of the um, parameters that we set were to be able to create a level of flexibility that requires you not to be, well, doesn't require you to be in any one particular place. And obviously we're selling a physical product. It's a little bit harder if you're the person who's physically popping it in the envelope and sending it out and printing the labels and that kind of thing. Um, but because we have aspirations to be able to travel the world at some point in the not too distant future, we want the, the side to hustle challenge is to try and create side hustles that can be done from anywhere. Um, and what I see as a really great opportunity is uh, to, to be able to create books that can be sold on Amazon. Um, I've mentioned it before, but I'm going to sort of describe it in detail in this video as well. So Amazon has a um, print-on-demand platform, which is really cool. So there's a number of different ways you can sort of make money through Amazon, but one of the ways is their print-on-demand book service. So um, what that entails is once you've got your book, so I've got my physical book um, that had uh, you know a, a digital file was created to be able to print that book. And so um, that digital file obviously gets sent to my local printer, they print out the books and make the hard copies. But within Amazon, they have an option to load that file to their platform and then people can order the books um, in a print-on-demand fashion. Now, I didn't know this, but actually a lot of the books we all probably have ordered off Amazon are created in this way. So it doesn't, like the customer doesn't even know that it's done as a print-on-demand. So if I order a copy of my favorite author's book from Amazon, chances are that it is produced through this print-on-demand process where the author's loaded the file to the website, then when you click um, order a copy and ship to me in New Zealand, then um, what happens is Amazon, uh, through their processes, I don't even know exactly how it happens, sends the book for printing at a printer and then it gets shipped directly to your customer. So actually you don't actually have any hands in the process at all other than originally you set up your listing on Amazon and load the file and from there it then becomes an uh, Amazon process. So um, what's really attractive in terms of this side hustle challenge is that once you've done the initial setup work, which you can do again from anywhere in the world, that is able to be sold over and over again without you having any um, any real input into that process. So that to me is just like a really perfect um, side hustle if you can get it working. And um, the other way too, obviously, well, you might have come across books on Kindle, you know, digital books, um, you can read on your, your iPad or on your Kindle device. And so that's another way through Amazon where you can have a digital file that um, your customers are able to buy your book in a digital format and read it that way. So uh, how is it going for me at the moment? Well, I've got my one, one book that I've written, my children's book that I've written, and that is on Amazon uh, now. I have sold a few copies of it, um, a couple of print demand copies and um, I think a couple of digital copies as well. Uh, but it's early days for me with this. Uh, one of the things I'm struggling with at the moment, which I'm trying to get my head around a bit, is how to get traffic to the listing. So the biggest thing it seems with the Amazon um, system is that it's obviously all run by a big algorithm that um, sort of dictates how people, well, what people get to see. Like a lot of things we have with our Facebook and that kind of thing, the algorithm decides um, whose posts we're gonna see. And, and um, so in terms of Amazon, if people aren't seeing your listing, then obviously they're not gonna be buying your book. So. Um, it's about figuring out how to actually get people to that listing and that's something that I am still working on at the moment. 
advertising obviously is one possibility but um, I so far haven't quite nailed that yet so I'll let you know how I go as time goes on with that um, and yeah um, but yes I definitely think it's got a lot of potential as a side hustle when you look on Amazon you can see actually for a lot of the listings how many copies of the books they're selling each month which gives you kind of an indication of the kind of numbers that someone might um, be turning over and again the on, t on the money side of things um, obviously you know it's pretty hands-off the margins are fairly small because a lot of the work's handled by Amazon so um, so you know again like a lot of these side hustles you have to get the volume through if you're actually going to um, make a significant amount of money off doing that but um, potentially a really good side hustle option um, depending on how you do it you know if you do um, a lot of the setup and design work yourself it's a way where uh, you know you can create a product a digital product and test it out without having to have a, um, a little awful lot of money invested into the, the project unlike if you have a physical product or you know like the physical books that I've printed you obviously have to produce that print it hold stock etc so um, so yeah, there's some real advantages to being able to do it the digital way. Um, I will get around to at some point sharing some numbers about the physical books as well, because uh, I think some of you might be interested in that side of things as well. So while it doesn't sort of strictly fit within the six figure side hustle challenge, it is um, it is starting to recoup a good chunk of the cost that I spent up front. So you could see that over time, um, once you've recouped those initial setup and design costs for creating the book, that it could be a way of adding another stream of side hustle income as well. So I hope you find that helpful if you're looking at getting into books and make sure that you hit subscribe so that you keep up to date with all of the side hustle videos and the monthly updates. I'd like to talk to you again soon. Bye.